welcome back to my channel. My name is Molly, if you haven't been here before. And today I am on another road trip because you all know how much I love a road trip. And I have come up to the Yorkshire Dales in the north of England to spend the weekend. I am meeting friends later on this evening, but today I've had the whole day to myself to explore. So I have first, I've literally just got here, I first come to Silverdale, which is one of the dales, and it sits on the west coast. I was gonna do this video outside, but it's pretty windy and you wouldn't be able to hear me and the wind noise would be really annoying. So I will edit in a clip now and show you exactly how beautiful it is around here. I have teamed up with Volvo, the car company, this weekend. So they have lent me kindly a V40 cross-country car, which I've just driven in and I'm sat in now. So I've driven this up all the way from London, which, on a straight journey is about four and a half hours. The drive was so nice because this car is such a nice car to drive. Um, it's got all the mod cons that I don't have in my car at home. So you know, like Bluetooth to play music and to talk on hands-free, um, it's automatic. It's just such a smooth drive. I'm gonna get out and have a little walk now and then we are going to head into the Yorkshire Dale National Park. I have driven straight from Silverdale into the Yorkshire Dales National Park where I have come to, if you can see in the background, Wensleydale Creamery. Anyone who is a Wallace or was a Wallace and Gromit fan like myself will know that this is where their famous cheese came from. Um, the Wensleydale cheese. I was actually researching before I came about the Wensleydale cheese factory, which is where I am, and they were about to close down until Wallace and Gromit made the cheese famous again. So now it's a thriving little business. We've got a museum and galleries how the cheese is made and they've also got a souvenir shop where you can buy the cheese and the cafe so I'm gonna go into the cafe and try some of the cheese. Here is the map of the Yorkshire Dales and this is exactly where the creamery is. That is my favourite cheese in the whole world. Like I've just ticked something off my bucket list that I didn't even know was on it, but that was insane. I mean, did you just see that cheese tasting? They had Wensleydale cheese with everything. They had it with rum, coconut, and pineapple. They had it with different liqueurs. They had it with cranberries, with blueberries. Oh, unreal, and it's free. The drive into the Yorkshire Dales National Park was actually stunning. Um, unfortunately, I couldn't film and drive, so I will get footage over the weekend and show you, but there's lots of little villages as you drive through, and it's full of these little jeeps. It reminds me of Emmerdale, and actually, the Yorkshire Dales is where Emmerdale was filmed. So, lots of farmland. I now have two hours before I go and meet the rest of the gang, so I'm just gonna go and have a drive and see what I find. driven about eight kilometers I think down the road into a village called Ingleton in the Dales um, which is where we're going to be based for the weekend. I have arrived first. I am just waiting now for the others to arrive. I think they got the train up so I'm going to finish some emails and I think this weekend's going to be jokes. Here we go. I'm excited. It's six o'clock in the morning. What are we doing today? The three peaks. Three Yorkshire <laughs> peaks. <laughs> You heard it. Today we are taking on the Yorkshire Three Peaks. It is now 6.30 a.m. and we are setting off for the first one. I mean, I don't we've, know how we're gonna make it if this one's this. reading the map, but <laughs> you know. I'm feeling positive so far, so. Positive vibes, positive vibes. We are on our way up the first of the Three Peaks. And I have 
out of breath. <laughs> As you can tell, it's pretty cloudy up here and we've already had quite a lot of rain. So, I mean, it's challenging, but me and Montana have got it. You got it in the bag. 